My guest this evening, Sharat Trivedi, is spokesperson of the BJP. Karan Varma is an author. Pankhuri Pathak is spokesperson of the Congress Party. And Faizan Kidwai is spokesperson of the Samajwadi Party. Uh, Faizan, for obvious reasons, I'm going to come to you first. One day, okay. you denounced the bulldozer and bulldozer action. Now, your own chief is threatening Yogi Adityanath of bulldozing his home in Gorakhpur. Either no. you support bulldozer action or you oppose it. You have to make up your mind, na? See, first of all, uh, bulldozer, as far as bulldozers are concerned, what Akhilesh was saying was in retaliation to what Mr. Adityanath said. See, just like Mr. Modi, Mr. Adityanath himself also suffers from what you call a God complex. He feels he's, he's also some sort of a pipe piper behind whom the entire Janta will come and the Janta will follow him blindly, but that's not happening. He lives under some sort of uh, an illusion that he can commit all sorts of atrocities on humanity and get away with it. I'm happy that the honorable courts have finally pulled down, mm. pulled up the yogi government, but I, I feel it's a bit too late. I wish the courts had had acted earlier and nipped this menace of uh, bulldozer Jangal Raj in the butt at the time it started. Pezan Kidwai, but I asked you a simple nahi, question. Hai, hai. I asked you a simple question. Yeah, if you are criticizing your Yogi Adityanath for his mm. bulldozer action, why is, why is Akhilesh Yadav threatening to do the same once he becomes chief minister? See, Akhilesh Yadav is not threatening Yogi Adityanath. I'll tell you what is happening in Gorakhpur. Just see the NCRB data. It says in 2020 in Gorakhpur, 1044 crimes happened, including 145 cases of rape, 234 cases of robbery. A report of wire. it says that criminals are getting a free run, those who are supposedly close to Bharati Janata Party. The Hindu report said, there's a one individual called Vinay Tiwari. He's accused of murder and a lot of other crimes. He was roaming freely. An Indian Express report says, there's Rajesh Yadav, a criminal with multiple cases, roams freely. See, in uh, uh, Gorakhpur, if you ask anybody, there's this uh, land mafia, sand mafia, unka raat chalta hai. And Mr. Adityanath is shielding them because majority of these criminals are close to Bharati Janata Party. So technically, what Akhleji is saying, that when the people of Uttar Pradesh will eventually elect uh, Samajwadi Party again in the state of Uttar Pradesh, and at that time, legally, whatever action would be taken, it will be taken. We are not going to do something which is unethical. We are not going to harm anybody. Any any citizen so of this country. That's not what he said. Our politics is no. very different from the kind of politics Yogi Adityanath does. Ten out of ten marks to you for research. Yeah. No, no. Ten, ten out of ten marks to you for research, and hundred out of hundred marks for uh, to you for for your diversionary tactics. Because that is ex no. not exactly what he said. Akhilesh Yadav is simply saying, "I will become chief minister, so I will send you to the bulldozer." No, no, no. When Yogi anyway, says, let, nahin, "Mr. Trivedi, uh, no, nahin, let, let me respond to this. Let me respond Haan. to this." Yogi Adityanath ne bola tha ke bulldozer ka dimag hota hai to i don't know wo kahan se pad ke aaye hain to to that akhilesh ji said bulldozer ka dimag nahi hota hai bulldozer ko instructions diye jate hain to instructions janta tay karegi yogi uh, 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 akhilesh ji said janta tay karegi bulldozer kis direction mein jayega wo gorakhpur bhi ja sakta hai aur ho sakte hain delhi wale bulldozer inhi pe chala den ki political khwahishon pe to ye bhi bola tha akhilesh ji ne to yogi ji i'll let you respond uh, Shreya, first of all, that... Uh, okay, I'll let Sharat Trivedi ji, spokesperson of the BJP, respond. Shreya, in not a single case where the demolition took place, the person whose house or property was demolished has gone to the court. Because they know that it is it was illegal. The uh, the reason, uh, the, the organization which has gone to the court has nothing to do with Uttar Pradesh. That's it not is true. Jamaat -Islami. The Jamaat-e Islami has gone to the Supreme Court and the order the Supreme Court has said That's is... That's not true, that Trivedi ji. That is not true, Trivedi ji. No, there are two they, other people apart from the Jamaat who have gone to the Supreme Court. They, and both they, individuals are ones who have suffered at the hands of bulldozers. No, no. Those, those, two, those two cases have nothing to do with Uttar Pradesh. One is in Rajasthan and the other is in uh, Madhya Pradesh. Where one, the tenant's house, uh, the landlord's house was demolished for the crime committed by the tenant. And in the second case, the father, the crime committed the by... The party is in Rajasthan and Madhya Pradesh. Mein. 
नथिंग टू डू विथ बीजेपी ही तो है सरकार में मध्य प्रदेश और राजस्थान में आई एम नॉट अ स्पोक्स मैन फॉर मध्य प्रदेश प्रॉपर्टी विच वॉज कंस्ट्रक्टेड ऑन आईदर गवर्नमेंट लैंड और इट वॉज इलीगल और इट वॉज विदाउट द कॉर्पोरेशन परमिशन that was the reason so uttar pradesh is completely absorbed and supreme court has said that they plan to make a national uh, set of guidelines and the uh, what my friend Shagaji, faizan if i remember correctly time. the supreme court has summoned uttar pradesh along no, with madhya pradesh and rajasthan yes, yes but the Haven't they in this bulldozer case no no the supreme court has not said that they are going to go into the illegal demolitions or they are going to go into the fact of the matter of how many demolitions have taken place the supreme court has said that they have given an order that national level guidelines have to be laid down on further demolitions if they at all happen in uttar pradesh my my friend faizan during the tenure of his party the chairman noida authority who was a rank of chief sec of secretary he was beaten up in his own house by uh, the uh, by luminary from his party minister ratik ahmed and uh, dsp in uh, in uh, pratapgarh was shot because the local mla trivedi ji acha let's get back to the topic ठीक है अब ये ना वी हैव डिस्कस दिस मेनी मेनी टाइम्स ऑन बुलडोजर किसके घर में चलता है बीजेपी इज हैकनीड आर्ग्यूमेंट इज दैट ऑल ऑल दिस इज इलीगल कंस्ट्रक्शन टू विच द सुप्रीम कोर्ट इट सेल्फ एट सेड दैट डजेंट साउंड वेरी ट्रू बट चलिए टुडे दैट इज नॉट समथिंग वी आर डिस्कसिंग वील डिस्कस इट वेन द सुप्रीम कोर्ट फाइनली पुट्स आउट इट्स गाइडलाइंस along with other states the state of uttar pradesh has also been summoned and let's be honest there's a reason why yogi adityanath is called bulldozer baba now it's a fact that many people in up do support his actions but the fact is the bu- bulldozer honestly when i see a bulldozer demolishing homes to me it's demolishing the rule of law in india's democracy and constitution but sharat trivedi ji let's get back to the subject we uh, what we do you have- make of अखिलेश यादव नाउ सेइंग नाउ सेइंग दैट मैं बुलडोजर गोरखपुर भेजूंगा आई मीन इफ आई वर यू आई वुड से इमिटेशन इज द बेस्ट फॉर्म ऑफ फ्लैटरिंग we are now we are not saying that it is going to go to a certain place because i want to send it to that place but if some illegal thing happens and that place the bulldozer would go there this is what vendetta is about what uh, the samajwadi party played during uh, the uh, the four tenure they were given in uttar pradesh uttar pradesh was thrown to dogs Hmm. the date which uh, mr yogi was given was to control the crime we have uh, cracked down on the organized crime hmm. we are ev- in every field uttar pradesh is on the lowest order in the case of uh, convictions also in uh, case of uh, the electronic evidences we have had 83% conviction rate in uttar pradesh no. today the fir's are not written Aap because of the we just come here uh, नहीं नहीं नाउ नो 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 नो